Assalamu alaikum everyone. Today we are going to present our group presentation entitled Business ID Presentation for our company Nathana.co. Nathana.co is a business that sells fashionable clothing, specifically well known nation brand Sabila and Busana Sofia Emerald. The tagline Bajuta Begoso is used to entice customers who know and be engaged with this brand. As seen, our expertise is to produce a budget product that is easy to style for all sizes, islanders, and affordable by maintaining Malay customs. Our customer segments is oversized women, pregnant women, college students, and for overall is Muslim women. Oversized women and pregnant women can wear the apparel conveniently because material used is high quality that does not show the shape of the body while clothes material and cool and pleasant to wear. And always for college students, people will like the most easy and fastest way to get ready for the class. Customer Relationship Customers can discover our products by watching advertisements on social media platforms such as Instagram, Facebook, WhatsApp and TikTok. Customers can purchase the products through ours as a dropship. We have different promotions every day to make customers not miss out an opportunity to grab and purchase their products in order to maintain their custom our customers' relationships. Channels If there is any latest update, the dropships will spread the news through social media. In this way, we can engage more clients in our business. Facebook is for giving impressions for our business. Instagram attractively designed so that what, uh, people can be tempted. WhatsApp uh, to get uh, the latest information about Sabina products and TikTok to catch the short videos to attract people knowing our products well. Value proposition given to the customers is the production of blouse and baju kurung that are specifically for women, especially Muslimah. The specialty of this product is iron dust that easily to wear for travel. Next, despite of the affordable price, it is also fit to all sizes from XS to 5XL. Furthermore, it always keeps things up with fast changing fashion trends, sweet with Malaysian uh, taste and the most portrait for the most important is to covering the aura according to the Sharia guidelines. Okay, we continue to key partners. It refers to business partners in conducting business. It includes founders, leaders, downline, team members and suppliers as well as third parties that we have to deal with regularly in business. These business partners are important in conducting business activities. Why do we need these partners and suppliers? Of course, we can't do everything when running a business. Among them, we can build alliance to optimize business, reduce risk and get more business resources at a more profitable cost. Next, key activities. It refers to what a business entity needs to do to ensure a successful business model. These key activities are needed to build a value proposition, build and support relationship with customers and subsequently generate revenue. And it is closely related to the type of business conduct such as marketing, sales, delivery, management and packaging. After that, key resources refers to important assets or resources required to ensure that business activities can run. Key resources can be things in the form of physical resources that is must have a device to do promoting activities. Human resource it is important, especially in the business model for the online business industry, such as dropship. Intellectual resources such as brands, knowledge, patents, and copyright are included. Such uh, intellectual resources are also better known as intellectual property. Customer database are also included in the intellectual resources category and also financial, which is cash, which is the main item in business, such as online banking. Then, cost structure refers to all the costs involved in running a business based on the planned business model. That is, the marketing cost, the use of internet data becomes a mandatory network to continue the business. Management cost with good management when in the business process, such as delivery costs taken to deliver goods to customers. And the product cost, which is bond, in the, is the cost of buying a plastic parcel of clothes to be packed for the customer. And the last one, revenue streams. It refers to the comes of stream that can be generated from a business. This involves us providing products and service related to the business being conducted. In a situation as a dropship, you will get the proceeds from the amount of commissions earned when the shirt is successfully sold. 
So is the result made itself and dropship revenue from online sales, from website and social media. And lastly, with the delivery charge service, the total cost in is increased slightly from the cost price to be able to cover the amount of car fuel used during delivery. Next is description of product. Lantana.co sells Sabella and Busana Sofia products, which consists of various design of men's and women's clothes, including baju kurung, dress, baju layu, blouse, telekung, and many more. Name and type of product. For name of product, we have choose two, which is Sabella and Busana Sofia. Uh, first is Sabella. Sabella is product brand that produce various type of male and female clothing, from free size to plus size, including adult and children clothing. And Sabella also an island, ironless clothing that facilitate and provide customers comfort. Second is Busana Sofia. It is also a product that produce variety of fashionable clothes which are baju melayu, baju kurung and many more. For type of product, uh, which is male and female attire. X is target market. We have choose two, which is those who looking for ironless attire. And second is those who looking for a family attire, including parent and kids attire. Hi, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Now, I will explain about the competitors and competing alternative. For the competitors, knowing our competitors is important for a firm like us. In the sector, there are a lot of competitors, especially for our company. These are the list of our competitors, which are Hasnuri Exclusive, Elra Exclusive, Angun Collection, Dia Cotton, Bulan Bintang, and Aish Mam. Next is... Competing alternative in this section, our company will use three strategy. First is marketing tool and strategy. Second is management strategy, and lastly is productivity strategy. For marketing tool and strategy, one of the marketing techniques that can draw people attention to our product and brand is by using social media such as Facebook, Instagram, and website. This method allow customer to learn more about our product while also viewing all of our current promotions. We can also collect information about what customer require using this platform. As a result, this plan will benefit us because we will be able to cut marketing costs while increase lead creation. For management strategy, this approach describes how we manage our stock so that it is constantly available. Customer will be able to buy our goods more easily if our stock is always available. They did not need to look in other place. This will result in long-term product support and the birth of a loyal customer as well as increase our, pro our profit. Lastly, for productivity strategy, in order to provide comfort to clients who use our product, it is also built from a high quality materials. For instance, the fabric we use is easily to rub and does not crumple and it is always in style. Furthermore, our items are sold at a fair price which help improve client confidence in our product's quality. That's all from me. Thank you. Now, I would like to tell you about the prices that we decided to sell our products for our business. As you see from the slide above, there are two different brands that we sold for our business. One is Busana Sofia, while the other one is Sabila. For the Sabila one, there are adult and male attire with items we are sold we sold at RM99 per item, while the adult and female attire is sold at RM79, in which also if they bought uh, the customer buy in two pieces, which is combo, the, uh, the prices will be at 69 per each, while the kids one is sold at RM69 for one item, and for a combo of two, each will be cost at RM59. While the Busana Sofia, the adult male attire is RM105, while adult female attire is 135 and kids attire is RM99. Next, point number 5, illustrations of our products. Okay, the first one is Sabila Baju Kurung. There are many types, uh, design, colors and also size for the customer to choose whatever they want. Okay, the second one is Sabila Pretty Clothes where there are two sizes. Uh, the first one is for women and adults and also for the children. And the last one is Busana Sofia. Point number 6, now we will move to vision and missions of Lantana. The first one is our missions. Lantana encourage the creativity and also promotions of individualism through the, the fashions and designs of ent entire Muslim at affordable price. One is our visions. Lantana will uh, efficiently, competitively and also provide the best quality for it. Muslim attire for teenagers, adults, children by growing our uh, startup business uh, to a household brand name. 
that's all from us thank you and assalamualaikum